What are you going to do about it? What are you really going to do about it? What's up you guys? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today we have another video for you guys. And today we're going to talk about five things that you need to do to change in 2024. Like it's 2024, you're tired of all the things that you've been doing, you're tired of it and you want to make a change. So what are you going to do about it? What are you really going to do about it? Well, if you follow these five tips, you are sure to achieve anything that you want to achieve in 2024 my first tip is to find a purpose so what why are you even trying to change what's the reason what's your why i know people always say it like but why why do you want to change what is so bad about what you're going through right now what is so bad about your current situation why do you want to change so find that purpose for me my purpose is god and it's always going to be god because i know he did not put me on this earth to suffer and he did not put me on this earth to be stagnant so i'm gonna keep it pushing every single time okay so that's my purpose and yours can be whatever it is that you um feel like it is that you're missing right now so what do you what is it that you want to change and why you want to change it tip number two is set a goal what is the goal that you're trying to achieve so when you have a clear defined purpose and what is it that you want to do you're going to be more motivated to work on that thing and also set small goals and set year goal what is it that you want out of that year and make small goals that you're going to work on every month of that year so it doesn't have to be this one huge unrealistic task tip number three is take action stop overthinking things that will make you crippled that personally speaking overthinking has crippled me for so long okay i would overthink i would think the content i would think the mess out of the content i would um plan the mess out of the content but i've never created the content like girl take action so set your goals and take action if you have everything you need if you don't have everything you need you would literally know what you need the next time so let me give you let me give you guys an example um, I wanted to create a reel, like a day in the life reel. I planned it and planned it and planned it, never took action. But when I finally did take action, in my head, I told myself, this is a practice round. And if it turned out great, wonderful. I, I can use that reel or those footages. But if it doesn't turn out great, I took action. And from that, I learned what is it that I need to do take action and those actions gonna lead to you learning and it's just gonna make you keep going tip number three is to listen and to do things that align with your goal this is so important guys like if you want to do something you are what you consume period if you want to be healthy you gotta eat healthier if you want to be an athlete, you got to work out or practice whatever that sport is. So you have to consume what you want to do. If you want to work on your religion, for example, listen to religious podcasts, listen to gospel music, get out your Bible and start reading. You literally have to consume whatever it is that you are wanting to do surround yourself with that and it'll be easier to get your goals done whenever you're not in the line with that in your mind is like wait this is not like conducive to what i'm trying to achieve so you'll just shift back to working on your goals and surrounding yourself with what you want to do so definitely consume 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 last but not least build a routine build a routine because you are hum a human being you're gonna mess up you're gonna not want to do things but if you build a routine then you know that you have to do those things 
um, and routines help you stay on track because if you build a routine and you do something every single day when you don't do it you feel like you let yourself down at least that's how I feel when I don't stick to my routine um, I feel like I let myself down so I don't want to let myself down I, and it literally makes me feel bad about myself so if I don't want to make myself feel bad about myself then I should definitely stick to my routine these are the five things that are going to help you achieve whatever it is that you need to achieve in 2024 um let me know what some of the things that you guys are doing to achieve your goals down in the comment section down below and let's talk about it i'll see you guys next time and thank you for watching don't forget to share like comment and subscribe bye